We've got a Pixel phone loaded with the latest test build of Project Astra, and we're going to leave the office to test it around London. I've got this email with apartment info. Can you tell me the door code and remember it? I'll remember the door code for you. It is 1170. To unlock it, enter the code and then press the unlock button. Based on these symbols, how should I wash this? The tag shows to machine wash at 30 degrees Celsius. Avoid bleach and tumble drying, iron on low, and dry cleanable. Then what setting should I use on this machine? Based on the laundry instructions of 30 degrees Celsius, select the 30 setting under Easy Care on the dial. I've got this list of recommendations. Can you tell me a bit about some of them? I can search for these places for you. Cold Drops Yard is a shopping destination with unique industrial design. Luminary Bakery is a social enterprise bakery, and Tate Modern is a modern and contemporary art museum. Now we're going to try Project Astra out on the street. Let's see what it can do. I've always said scone, but now I'm hearing people say scone. Can you help me with the pronunciation? It's a fascinating topic, the pronunciation of scone. Both scone rhyming with gone and scone rhyming with bone are accepted pronunciations, though regional variations exist. What can you tell me about this sculpture? The sculpture you're seeing is called My World and Your World by Eva Rothschild, located in Lewis Cubitt Park in London. What kind of themes does her work explore? She creates abstract sculptures that invite viewers to interact with and interpret their surroundings in new ways. Uh, would these do well if I planted them back home? Mountain fleece can grow well in New York. They prefer full sun to partial shade and moist, well-drained soil. So your garden in New York should be a good fit for these flowers. I'm trying to get a gift for my friend, and this is everything she's been reading. How would you describe her taste in books? Based on these titles, your friend seems to enjoy a mix of history, biography, and perhaps a touch of political or social commentary. I picked some of these out. Any idea which one she'd like the most? Consider Half of a Yellow Sun for its exploration of complex social and political issues within a historical setting, aligning with her interest in narratives that offer insight into significant periods. Will that bus take me anywhere near Chinatown? Yes, it does. The 24 bus route goes through Leicester Square, which is very close to Chinatown. Are there any landmarks on the way? Riding the number 24 bus, notable landmarks you will likely encounter are Westminster Abbey, Big Ben, and Trafalgar Square. I also met up with some friends to test out the multilingual capabilities. Est-ce que tu peux me dire quelque chose d'intéressant pour pousser lanternes? Bien sûr, je peux vous parler des lanternes. Les lanternes que vous voyez font partie de la porte d'entrée de Chinatown à Londres. Elles ont une signification culturelle pour les Chinois et sont souvent utilisées pendant les célébrations et les festivals. Le pâté variolage sur l'ombre là. Et chez Maga. Now I'm using these prototype glasses to test Project Astra hands-free. Can you check if it's going to rain anytime soon? It looks like it is currently mostly sunny in London. Rain is expected tonight from around 10 p.m. until tomorrow morning at 6 a.m. Hey, what's that park next to me? The park looks to be Primrose Hill, known for its panoramic city views and the notable Shakespeare's tree. Can you check if I can bike in there? It appears that cycling is actually banned within Primrose Hill itself, although it is permitted in nearby areas and the rest of Regent's Park. I'm biking back to Camden. Can you check if there's any supermarkets along the way? There's a Sainsbury's on Camden Road, a Morrison's on Chalk Farm Road, and an M&S Simply Food on Camden High Street. What was the door code again? The door code you saved previously is 1170. Oh, thanks. That works.